Good morning. Put the flash on. Because it's so dark this morning. It's so, it's so early. Are you still sleepy? Sleeping beside your bed as usual. Are you strange boy? That's how dark it is out there. Do I have to pay the toll to get past? <laughs> Gotta pay the toll. Ready to go? Do you want to pay the toll though? Do you want to pay the biscuits? Oh, where are you going? Enough to get it. Just checking you're getting the right ones. You want another one? Okay, where's my fingers? Are you stamping your foe at me? You are? All right, stampy Paul. Right, that it? Time to go? Come on in. It's like the old fashioned, I bite my thumb at you, sir. to see what you found. Ready? Ready? Are you gonna get it or not? Come on then. Ready? This way. Oh you're in past it. That's why you're slowing down. Oh got it. swim and stuff. Oh, you were so cute. How are you getting the belly out, are you? Okay. Oh. <laughs> Gotta pay the toll. <laughs> Nobody's allowed to get away without rubbing your inside leg and your belly. There. Come on then. To no, make a little bit of room. <laughs> How many tolls do I have to pay? Go on then. Okay, lots and lots. Look at that door. Babies. Oh, babies. Oh, it's a cuddle. Come on. 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 Come it was fine. You have quite a sort of a... I did mean to record myself packing orders, but now I've only got one hat left. Um, I do have how many more orders? Like seven more orders to pack, but only one hat <laughs> because I've packed all the other ones up already. Um, so I'm just going to 
pack this next order which is for Cynthia and it is this one black slouchy hat with fluff my life so um if it wasn't clear in my last vlog when you want to order a hat like this you go to the hat listing of the colour choice you like so pick your colour hat um, and then there's a link directly to the patch listing so you order the patch separately because you can order the hats without a patch if you don't want a patch you can also leave a note if you want the pom-pom to be removed after you've selected your hat colour you go to the patch listing and you select your patch um, if you want to order the patch to keep it separate so you can stitch it on whatever you want then please make a note of that because I will automatically if there's one hat and one patch I will sew it on if you order two hats and two patches then please put a note when you're making your order to say which hat patch goes on which colour hat unless they're both the same um, then it'll be obvious um, but yeah if you want to order a patch to sew on something else but you also want to order a hat just make sure you make a note of it um, and they can only go on to these slouchy hats anyway um, the smaller ones these hats the brim's not wide enough for a patch uh, I've only got two of these left and then they're gone. I'm not making them again. So there's just two silver hats like that left. You got some delivery. I'm back. Um, so yeah, hopefully that's clear then. That if you order a slouch hat, um, I, I can't put the patches onto the hand knitted hats because again it's not designed for the patches so if you order a hand knitted hat and a patch you'll get them both separately because they won't be attached together the patches only go on the slouch hats um hopefully i made that clear in um the actual listing my hair looks terrible <laughs> it's fluffy all over the place i haven't fixed it since i went swimming um okay i think <laughs> i think i've described that enough and hopefully by the time you see this video I will have restocked all of the hats and also added some new colours. I've definitely knitted um, a new colour hand knitted hat um, and I know I've done a new colour so far of the these hats, a mushroom colour, um, and then I ran out of yarn. <laughs> so I ordered a load of yarn yesterday. Hopefully it will arrive before the end of the week, it's currently Wednesday. Um, and then I can make loads more hats and restock them before Sunday when this video comes out. Um, but that is reliant on the yarn arriving because I use two different yarns. Um, this is an Aran weight yarn because it's the kind that go through my machine. I've got a circular knitting machine, which I'll insert some footage of.
I'm loving so much. It's so cute. <laughs> Take your pick. That's how it's going to be tacked down. And then the hand knitting, I use a chunk, uh, like a bulky, it's called a soup. If you're American, I think they call it a bulky. Um, in the UK, we call it super chunky. And that's what I use to do the hand knitted hats. So these are double wool. So there's two, two walls. And the hand knitted ones are single wool because they are super chunky. I keep on going off on tangents, but I should really pack this order now. So all of these hats um, are gonna be hand wash only. Sorry, Cynthia, your bag's a bit squiff. <laughs> Try and get the air out. I don't have big enough tissue paper to wrap them, so they're in compostable bags. And then I also need to get some smaller um, delivery bags because these are for my cushion, so they're way too big. These are also compostable and biodegradable and recycled. I try to squeeze out as much air as I can to try and save on postage because that's why it's going to Texas. Um, so this vlog is probably going to be um, spaced out over a week so that I can put bits in of me doing different hats along the way. That's a, a key plushie. <laughs> this is little guy Dale, no said. My mum does the um the plushie testing. So she tests the eyes, she takes the battery stopper out and tests that they still talk properly. Um, and then puts the stopper back in, puts in the instruction for the battery, uh, thank you card. Um so that they're ready for me to pack away. One to put into all this when people want them. This is for clay in PA. Where's PA? I cannot think of a state beginning with PA or, or does the A not need to be the second letter, like Texas? So PA could be Pennsylvania, maybe? I <laughs> can't get this label off. I'm going to go with Pennsylvania. Correct me in the comments. There's a calendar and a plushie and a book. I need to bleed in my book display. So we ordered a book, and when you order our book from us, you get keys for signature inside. Um, and we have a deal. My hair coming down over my eye. We have a deal um, where you can save money if you buy the plushie and book together. I can't remember how much you save, but it's a good deal. It's book. And, um, I would normally protect the book in a bag, but it's gonna go the box is gonna go inside a bag, so I don't need to. Do you need to stop it from sliding about some these are compostable? Um no. These are dissolvable packing peanuts. So you literally just put them under the tap and they will disintegrate. Turn into a little slimy sludge and then disappear. So the box with the books goes inside a bag <laughs> and then the plushie goes in the bag too.
Hello. I'm just going to show them the hats I've made to restock my website. <laughs> so I've been knitting like crazy since the hats went on on Sunday and you guys basically sold me out. <laughs> you ordered them so fast that by the next day they were all gone. So um, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much for loving my hats. I've just got into knitting and I love hand knitting. Um, these ones are fun too. They're a lot quicker to make. They take a lot more yarn, but they're quicker. Um, these ones obviously take a lot longer because they're hand knitted. Um, a thicker yarn and a bit less, like you only single layer instead of double layer. So I've got a silver, it's a black and white. Um, and then this one is my pink and cream heart. This is a new shade called Mushroom. So I've got two of those. I've got another parchment, a mocha. I've got two of the pale rose, a camel and a graphite. And I've got a load more yarn on the way. This is literally all of the yarn that I'd bought made into hats now. So I've ordered a load more yarn. Should hopefully arrive today. A few different colours, some bright colours, some reds and blues and things. Uh, I had gone a bit crazy with the neutrals. <laughs> Um, but I'm going to do some brighter colours as well. And these are the ones that can take the patches on, on the brim. So they sit, sit there. So you can have key leather patches. I'll show you those in a moment. It's faux leather, not real leather. The patches don't really go on these hats. So if you ordered this hat and this hat and a patch, I'd automatically put the patch on this hat because I don't put them on these ones. And then I've also got these ones. So there's uh, an oatmeal, which is also on the website already. And then I've got a rainbow. How pretty is that? And then this one is mustard. There's another of these pink ones. And then there's pink. And this cute, so cute. Uh, I've got two of the rainbow ones so far that I've made. But I need to make pom-pom and I need to laser out some more tags because I've ran out. And I'm also running out of the faux leather I make the tags and the patches from. I made a headband as well to try out. That needs pressing. <laughs> I need to steam press it so that it's a bit flatter. Um, and I also need to press these ones. Um, and this is the one I'm working on at the moment, which I haven't done yet, which is a really nice gradient. So pretty. Oh, and I forgot to mention that I've changed the pom pom. So for these ones, you still get a faux fur pom pom, which is detachable by the button on the inside. There's an elastic on the pom pom and it just wraps around the button on the inside. I should probably show it. Can you see that? So there's a little button and it's got a notch on either side where the elastic fits in. So you can take the pom pom off. And if you've got a hook of some kind, then you can put it back on again. Um, and then these ones, the hand knitted ones, I've decided to put, I forgot to change that one. <laughs> I've decided to make yarn pom-poms for because they're so soft. This is the softest pom-pom I've ever felt. They are so cute. So yeah, these all have the yarn pom-poms now and I'll update the listing photos. But look at this, it's so cute. Um, and then these are the patches. So these are the ones I've got ready. At the moment, oh, just a bit out of order for some reason. I've got two talk to the paws, <laughs> two fluff off, or three talk to the paws, talk to the paw. Um, and then we've got fluff my life. This was the most popular one, it was the first one to go. Uh, and then mind your own fluff. <laughs> There's also a just roll with it patch, um, and I need to cut out a couple of those. I'm running very low on this faux leather and it seems to be very difficult to find this particular kind which doesn't have a, an adhesive on the back because they're stitched on. But yeah, these are your patch options for the hats. <laughs> um, and if you order a hat and a patch, I will automatically stitch them on if it's in the same order. If you want to order a patch to sew on something else but you also want to order a hat, Make a note in your order that you don't want the patch attached <laughs> to the hat. Otherwise, I'll just automatically attach it. If you order a patch with a hand knitted hat, I won't attach it unless you specifically ask me to in the note because it's not made for it. Like it, the brim's not really wide enough for it. It doesn't look quite right. 
so I wouldn't I wouldn't actually automatically put it onto a hand knitted hat only on the slouch hats and if you order multiple hats and multiple patches and they're different let me know which patch goes on which hat in your notes because uh, you can make a note when you make your order and look this is my hat this one's mine my favorite one I made for myself and then this is my slouch hat that I made for myself it's got a talk to the poor so those ones are mine I need to make some more of these now because I'm almost out um, out of the hand knit ones because then those are sewn on I've got a few of these left and I'm waiting for the yarn I can't make any more of these hats until the yarn arrives but I need some more these ones because I am making a hat and I have a hat that doesn't have a tag yet I also need a tag for the headband oh I just want to keep knitting <laughs> It's crazy. Oh, and also, the um, these are the buttons. So even these, uh, wrong, bad example, even these pom-poms are removable. So I use slightly bigger buttons because they actually hold the pom-pom on better when I just stitched them in. They were really floppy. But having the flat button on the back keeps them upright properly. So they're, they are easy to take off but they won't just fall off. So you can take the pom-pom off of these ones if you want to. It's like, it's not too floppy. You're so cute. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm squishing my hand. I'm bending it backwards. Don't do it that way. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. You should never have brought me back. Oh my god. With interest free, flexible payment plans, we're making. I'm getting quicker at it. The clips before this, <laughs> I'm a lot slower, um, which is why I wanted to actually show how quick I can be now. I know I'm not nearly as quick as people that have been knitting for years, but I have only been doing this for about two weeks. So I'll let myself off. So thank you so much for all the love on my new hats. Uh, I know I am all over the place with all these crafts. I can't seem to help myself <laughs> discover a new craft and then I'm just head first into it to just keep to keep doing it. Like sleeping and eating at the moment has been a pain because it's stopped me from knitting. I've entered my granny phase. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm so glad that you love the hats as much as I love making them. Head over to the website now at the end of this video because it should be stocked up with hats. <laughs> um, and they did go very quickly the last time, last Sunday when I launched them. So if you would like a slouchy key hat or a hand knitted hat, uh, then go to designbyboo.com and check them out. Um, <laughs> there's a key fluff on my phone screen and I, I thought it was on my cheek, so I just wanted to blow it off, but it's not, it's on my my phone screen. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.